Knowing when and how to teach kids the truth about life in the womb may seem like a daunting task, but for this week's Pro-Life Focus, One New Children's Book is doing just that. When You Became You is a new book featuring illustrations and the biological science of human embryology to introduce the continuum of human life. It takes children on a scientific journey through the stages of a human being's life. The book was released in November. Joining us now on Skype are the authors of When You Became You, Brooke Stanton and Christiane West. Congratulations on the launch of your book. It is beautifully illustrated. Brooke, this book educates on the continuum of life. Can you explain that scientific reality and why that's so important to teach children? Sure, thank you, Catherine. When You Became You, again, is a scientifically accurate celebration of humankind and of our shared humanity in terms of human development. It teaches elementary school children when a human life starts, and it also introduces them to another amazing objective scientific fact called the continuum of human life. Using simple, scientifically accurate language and beautiful, engaging illustrations, the continuum of human life is so important because it states that a human being is the same whole individual and living human organism throughout all of the various stages of human development from the very beginning of one's biological existence as a human being until death. And considering human sexual reproduction, science knows that all human beings begin to exist at fertilization. This means that you have always been a human being, Catherine, an actual human being with a truly human nature. You are never just a bunch of cells or just a potential human being. It means that science knows a human embryo is a human being, a human fetus is a human being, a human infant is a human being, and on. Scientifically, there is no such thing as a human non-person. Right. This is awesome, important science, and it's not above anyone's pay grade. Everyone can and should know, even elementary school children. Absolutely. Christiane, you and Brooke are founder and co-founder of Contend Projects, a secular, nonpartisan science education nonprofit. But I understand you two would like to see this book in every Catholic school science classroom. Why is that? Well, as you know, Catherine, um, unfortunately, we have an education fail in this country. Um, almost 60% of American adults do not know that a, a fetus is an actual human being. And that statistic sadly includes Catholics. And that's manifest in our in Catholic views on abortion. Only about 42% of American Catholics think that abortion should be outlawed in all or most cases. So we have, uh, we have a problem, but we also have an opportunity uh, to solve for that. And uh, it starts in elementary schools. Elementary schools are culture makers. And so if we can teach this science early on, uh, we can have an impact on the culture. But we can also inoculate our children against the false science and the false information that they will hear around them. And it's a lot easier to do that now uh, while, while they're still young than to try to undo that damage uh, later on when they're in high school and they've been exposed to all kinds of uh, false uh, information. But we also think it's particularly important in Catholic schools because what we found is that a lot of Catholic schools um, talk about the start of a human life in uh, uh, religion and ethics classes. And, and that's very good. But unfortunately, that can also lead to the belief that this is a personal moral question as opposed to a resolved scientific fact that's absolutely undeniable. And you would have a very different discussion in your religion class if you taught this in, in, in your biology class and if it was uh, if students were well well-grounded in this science. So we definitely think all Catholic schools should have this in their libraries and that Catholic parents should be reading this to their children and engaging um, in this discussion and celebrating this amazing Absolutely. science. Absolutely. And more information at whenyoubecameyou.org. Congratulations again on the launch of your book. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.